There is some chatter that Spider-Man 4 is happening and that you'll be back as Spider-Man. <laughs> now we're here. What do you want to know? Now we're here. Now we're here. We're actually, we can, we're touching. Now we're in the same room. Can we confirm this tonight? It's happening. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, next summer, next summer we start shooting. Everything's good to go. We're nearly there. Super exciting. Oh, that's uh, fantastic. Yeah, I, I mean, can't you wait. You are so good and so uh, you're perfect for that role. Thank you. You're a good actor, you're also very charming and just I, I, I've, I have, I, I love it. But also I have kids and they love you so much. Thank <laughs> you so much. You're just the whole everybody in the cast. It's great. Good. Thank I'm happy you. to hear that. Before we start today's video, check out our new merch shop linked in the description below. Featuring new updated designs from your favorite Marvel projects. Use the code TEAMCAP or code IRONMAN in all caps to get 10% off of your order. Thanks so much and enjoy today's video. Hey everyone. What's up guys, unofficial MCU here. Hope you're all doing well, and in today's video we have some pretty breaking news. As you guys just saw there, Tom Holland had recently taken to confirm a number of things for Spider-Man 4. We of course are gonna go ahead, we're gonna hop right on into it, break it all down for you guys with everything that we know and everything that we're anticipating right now. Before we do though, however, grab that subscribe button if you haven't already, as we're discussing all types of Marvel related news, leaks, rumors, theories, and breakdowns here on the channel. So, if you guys are into any of that, go ahead and grab that subscribe button today. Also, be sure to hit that little notification bell right next to it to be notified for when we have new videos dropping here on the channel almost on the daily. There is a lot of Marvel news to keep up with. It's exactly why we're here, is to keep you guys updated with everything, not just that, but also break it down for you guys. As always, I really appreciate all of the support. Okay, so in this video, we are going to be taking a quick read from IGN.com as an overall garnering source. We'll have their article linked in the description down below for you guys to check out there as well. Spider-Man 4 confirmed at Marvel Studios. Tom Holland to begin filming in 2025. Uh, the Marvel Cinematic Universe is officially getting Spider-Man 4 as star Tom Holland had recently taken to confirm filming begins in summer of next year. Tom Holland finally confirmed the Spider-Man No Way Home sequel on The Tonight Show with Jimmy Fallon, saying plainly that it is happening. This is is the first time that we've actually heard anything confirmed, anything official from Tom Holland himself, or really into that regard of Marvel Studios, that this movie is actually happening, aside from the Hollywood trades and the different insiders and rumored reports that circulate around at times. Even then, it can very reputable, and even at that can be taken as a bit of a confirmation when you have sources like Deadline, maybe per se, covering or talking about a certain subject, for example, Spider-Man 4 in this case. And though various figures at Marvel Studios have also commented on the potential fourth Spider-Man Film as well for some time. This is the first official word that it is definitely coming and that it is definitely in the works. And even at that, even confirming that they begin filming in next year, saying next summer we start shooting, Tom Holland had said, and also goes on to say that everything is good to go. We're nearly there. It is super exciting. I cannot wait. No other details seem to have been revealed as of to what Spider-Man 4 will truly be about were shared, although a lot of other industry insiders and trades, uh, you know, uh, the occasional rumored reports have really said and circulated around saying that this is going to be a multiversal story. It's set to release between uh, Avengers Doomsday and Avengers Secret Wars, but Tom Holland's web slinger will also appear for Avengers Doomsday. He'll go off in between those movies, very similar to with what we saw with the last two Avengers movies, Avengers Infinity War and Avengers Endgame, having Captain Marvel stuck there in the middle and then he'll be back around for Avengers Secret War so what goes on with that is something that is going to have some heavy implications and even that that's some heavy setups for what we see go down in Avengers Secret Wars there as well uh, not just all of that Tom Holland had also previously said a script for the film is lit on fire for him he was over the roof on that and spoke on his desire to bring into the Spider-Verse protagonist Miles Morales into the MCU as well firstly he had said that he did read the script with Zendaya his girlfriend and that she will also be returning for Spider-Man 4 in the MCU as well. He reveals, talking about Miles Morales though, however, in another quote, if I were to be lucky enough to somehow bring Miles Morales into my Spider-Man universe and into the MCU, I'd love to do for a young kid what Robert Downey Jr. did for me, he says. 
Now, I can't completely, you know, say that this was something that was, uh, you know, said after the matter of him reading the script, but you know how Tom Holland is. He's a bit of a loud mouth, and it's something that he could have accidentally maybe have teased, or maybe even at that more purposely, maybe he'll get a slap on the hand over at Marvel Studios or at Sony. Maybe Miles Morales is a setup that they want to do for Spider-Man uh, Spider 4 in the MCU. The last film left off, and the last time that we saw the Web Slinger, a little bit more tragic than a lot of fans wanted to, with every Everybody forgetting who Peter Parker was. After ripping a hole in the multiverse, Tom Holland's Spider-Man had to raise himself from the mind of everyone that he's loved to fix it and really starting over, meaning his girlfriend MJ, his best friend Ned, and everyone else in the world never knew that he existed, who Spider-Man was, and who Peter Parker is as well. He's pretty much started from ground zero, so having MJ, uh, Zendaya, read the script here as well for Spider-Man 4 confirms that she'll be a part, she'll be back around, and maybe they'll rekindle that relationship that they had but before we see her in Spider-Man 4 we'll see Tom Holland and Spider-Man uh, you know appear in Avengers Doomsday as he had also confirmed that he will be filming his scenes for Doomsday before Spider-Man 4 he'll film his scenes for Doomsday and then go off and start on with Spider-Man 4 it feels like it might even be fitting you know for Morales to finally appear as the character usually emerges for and as a younger and you know kind of bungling Spider-Man alongside the older Peter Parker I'm not calling Tom Holland old but maybe after his next Spider-Man trilogies is where we'll see more of that setup. I think currently there's just too much going on to have Miles Morales set up quite yet with the MCU. They have a lot of implications as this is going to be a multiversal story. Miles Morales takes place within the actual MCU, unless you're watching the Spider-Verse movies. Either way, I'm, I'm over the roof for this. I'm super excited and I cannot wait. Thanks so much for watching today's video. Of course, this has been Unofficial MCU. Let me know all of your thoughts and opinions in the comments down below. Different theories as well, I'm all ears. Let's discuss, I love to hear what you guys are all thinking. Leave a like on today's video as it really does help out the channel, I really appreciate it. Stick around here on the channel, Unofficial MCU, by hitting that subscribe button and notification bell to be notified for when we have new videos dropping here on the channel, almost on the daily. There's a lot of Marvel news and craziness that has been going on that's exactly why we're here is to keep you guys all updated on all of it and explain it all also check out our merch shop linked in the description down below or to the channel also use codes team iron man or team cap in all caps depending on what team you are a part of to get 10 percent off of your order i'll be updating and dropping new designs on a regular basis so make sure you check it out it can make a perfect gift for someone else or even for yourself with whatever way you support the channel i really deeply do appreciate it. It. Whether it's simply watching today's video or purchasing one of our products, thank you guys so much. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Have a great one. Remember, with great power comes great responsibility. Peace out. See you, chump.